overview of my room as if you were coming in through the doorway. I guess I can go ahead and show you guys what is on this back wall, uh, the wall that you guys pretty much see in every one of my videos. Up there I have my live, laugh, love decal sticker thingy. It's my favorite quote of all time. And then I have this painting from Ikea just to kind of give my room a pop of color, even though it doesn't necessarily fit the grand scheme of things. I also have this futon and pillows that all came from Walmart, I believe. And then this little kind of like zebra print rug that does tie into the theme of my room. Zebra print, purple, black, white, whatever. Behind the door is just a very plain section in my room that's honestly lacking a lot of spunk. But over here we have kind of like this tie rack that the house came with, but I've decided to convert it into my very own jewelry organizer. I have all of my clutches and necklaces and random accessories. We also have a closet that I just kind of store a few of my extra clothes. And then we also have my studio light that I film with. Uh, typically it usually has like an umbrella over it, but right now it is on the floor. I'm just using this to kind of brighten up the darker side of my room. And then of course we have my nail polish rack that is falling to pieces because I have completely overstuffed it. So I'm planning on making um, two of these nail polish racks to fit all of my polishes because this is like toppling over. If you guys want a nail polish collection video, I will link it down below, so definitely check it out. This is my vanity table where I sit at when I'm filming, doing my makeup and all sorts of things. Because I do have a vanity tour up, I will link that down below and I won't go into too great of detail about it, but I will just kind of give you guys the basics. We have my ghetto chair that has tons of rips in it. It is literally old as sin, um, but I haven't found the perfect chair for my room yet, so we're kind of just dealing with it. And because it is lacking cushion, I've got one of these pillows on here. Um, that is how bad it is, ladies and gentlemen. Looks like Freddy Cougar took a bite, I know. Um, yeah, we just have that pillow on it for now. Down here I have a waste bin from Ikea, $1.99, big spender, I know. We also have these lights that are really, really handy when it comes to filming. I like them because they have three different settings. Got that from Target, a few different doodads, and you know what, ladies? I wanted to keep it real with you. This is what my desk looks like, typically. Nine times out of ten, it ain't perfect, it's dusty, it's dirty, and usually I have all my crap just spread out like I own the place. So right now I have a random makeup palette, a random brushes, a few bare minerals products I'm trying out. I'm actually going to do an updated foundation routine. This stuff is gold, I swear, I love it. Um, we have my brush holders over there. I do have a tutorial on how to make those if you want to check it out. My vanity mirror, my shred my mirror, my runa. A penis pup. Last but not least, I have my long tubed um, light from Ikea. The mirror, the desk, the light, and I think that's about it. It's all from Ikea over here. And then literally right next to my vanity, I have this little corner of my room that was really lacking some serious spunk. So I just recently added it to it. I got this lamp here from Walmart, and then there's my Rana, a couple of my favorite perfumes ever. Another jewelry organizer, except this one says live, laugh, love, or live, love, laugh, whatever. I think that's kind of backwards. Anyway, it's a jewelry organizer that I got from Mother's Day and actually got it from my mom. I have a few of my dangly earrings and studs, but I still have a lot more to add. Everything is sitting on this really inexpensive bookshelf that I also got from Walmart. And if you guys don't know me, I'm really cheap. So I was kind of happy about that. that This was only $15, and I can fit 12 pair of heels on here. So that's kind of cool because it gave me a lot more room in my closet and I think it's kind of cute the way I organized it. So. And right next to it we have a full size mirror. I am not going any more farther up the mirror, but basically just understand that it's full size and I am slacking in my sweatpants. Like you guys have no idea. I love, love, love just to chill with a baggy sweatshirt and some super duper saggy pants. Not gonna lie, so that is me on this rainy day. Hey girl. This little contraption here is where I store and organize all of my makeup. I actually purchased this from Office Depot about three years ago. If you don't have an Office Depot near you, you can definitely try Amazon or eBay and places like that. It's a really good way to organize your makeup. And the very last section of my room I have to share with you guys is this over here. It is right next to my makeup collection and smack dab in the middle from my futon. You guys probably see this, um, or very little of it in my uh, backgrounds of my videos and it is the smaller version of my vanity desk. I think this one is 
$49 at Ikea as well. And honestly, if you ladies are looking for something small that you can convert into a vanity or even like a really small desk that you can put your laptop on, I would seriously recommend this because for $49, it is such a bargain. And then on top of my desk, we have a few random doodads. The first thing is this pink tulip candle from Bath & Body Works. Then we have my Hello Kitty piggy bank. And then last but not least is this bouquet of flowers. They're obviously fake because me and flowers, we just, we don't, we don't get along. These are obviously artificial and my mom actually put this bouquet together and I think everything we purchased, we purchased from Michaels. And then intertwined in the flowers, I have these little snowflake lights that I got from Target in the $1 section last year. So I think that's pretty much a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I definitely had a blast showing you all around. If you have any questions about where I got something and the price and all that, and if it's not in the description bar below feel free to totally leave a comment also don't be shy if you have any collection videos or tours or anything you just want to share with me feel free to post it as a video response down below and like always I will definitely check it out so yeah thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and I will catch you guys all on the flip side bye